All told, Epatha descends from at least nine slaves who were owned by the Jesuits, including no less than three generations of her Hawkins family line. For an African-American family, this was an astonishing discovery. And as we dug deeper, we found something else, something that few of us are ever able to see, a description of how our enslaved ancestors were actually treated on the plantation. Generally, the master provided no bedding except a blanket and an old straw sack, which was placed on two or three planks laid across some old wooden horses. Some might think it harsh treatment to make the poor Negroes sleep on the floor, yet it is not hard to sleep thus, for a custom softens things. Ah, an old straw sack. And these are men of the cloth. Wow. How are you feeling so far? Um, I'm saddened to, of course, you know, you always think about it, but you never see it. Never see it. And, and when you can see it and then it's, it's, a, it's a painful process, mm -hmm. but it's also joyful. And so a part of the tears is, is joy that they were here and that whatever they went through, they withstood it. Yeah. They lived through it. Yeah. Um, and they lived through it long enough to get to me. Yeah. They endured. They endured. Yeah. It's, uh, so that you could thrive. 